We've got a few headlines I want to cover. Um, some big ones, actually. On Tuesday, July 15th, the interim CEO of Westinghouse, Dan Sumner, at an AI conference told President Trump that Westinghouse plans to build 10 large nuclear reactors in the United States uh, with construction to begin by 2030 in accordance with some of the executive orders that President Trump had signed um, a few months prior. Uh, This is great news. Um, Sumner said that these reactors would create about $75 billion worth of economic value across the country. And he was specifically talking about these large AP-1000 pressurized water reactors. They're capable of generating a gigawatt of energy, which is enough to power more than 750,000 homes apiece. Um, Westinghouse touts these as the most advanced commercially available nuclear reactors on the market. Um, China currently has four of them in operation and another 12 under construction. The U.S., um, in comparison, only has two up and running right now. So um, starting, you know, starting construction on a whole nother fleet of them in just a few short years um, is really great news just for the modernization of America's electrical grid and our ability to continue to power reindustrialization.